Hey, what's up and welcome to VS's God Roll Hunting. In this episode, we are reviewing the Shayuas Wrath, the season 14 season of the Splicer Trials SMG. The Shayuas Wrath is a void submachine gun located on the second weapon slot and uses primary ammo. Introduced in season 14, it is a possible reward in the Trials of Osiris playlist and the Adept version is obtainable. The Adept version has overall improved weapon stats when masterwork and can use the Adept mods. The weapon frame is the precision frame and contributes to a more vertical and predictable recoil pattern. With 25 impact and 600 RPM, it belongs to the same league as the Arcus SMG 70 U7. The base stats are slightly better in every aspect than of the 70 SMG and are extraordinarily good, but on the other side it can't create war mine cells. The high zoom of 17 enables a effective playstyle even in mid-range areas and is a unique property. This SMG can perform greatly in PvP and endgame and has several perks to highly improve the performance. The only damage perk is kill clip and can be adapted to any situation and with the usage of the adapt mods like the range or adapt reload speed, the high lethality of this weapon can even more be amplified. The masterwork is highly depending on the perk roll and almost every roll of this SMG will feel and play great. Besides that I can recommend a range, handling or reload speed masterwork especially in combination with kill clip. My recommended overall PvE roll has Fluted Barrel, Flat Mackerel and Kill Clip with a range masterwork. Fluted Barrel will highly improve handling and stability and Flat Mackerel will improve stability and reload speed and the improvement of reload speed will synergize greatly with Kill Clip which will increase damage when reloading after a defeat. The third row can highly profit from Quick Draw which will highly decrease draw time. Killing Wind which will improve handling, mobility and range after defeats and Tunnel Vision will highly increase target acquisition and aim down speed when reloading after a defeat. The recommended endgame role makes usage of Acura's Round which will highly increase range and celerity. Celerity will improve handling and reload speed and will highly increase the performance of the weapon. When one is the last living fire team member it will improve aim down speed, reload speed and handling and reduce flinch even more. PvP can adapt various playstyles and a max range focus role has hammer for trifling Acura's runs, kill clip and tunnel vision. Since a higher range highly benefits from target acquisition and stability improvements, perks like tap the trigger, dynamic sway reduction or heating up are also recommended, especially in combination with the adept range mod which would increase the effective range to almost 29 meters. Also solid alternatives are snapshot sight which will highly increase aim down speed and killing wind. A highly kill clip focus roll has flat magvel and a reload speed master work. Both will decrease the reload speed to 1.84 seconds and highly benefit the kill clip damage buff when reloading after a defeat. Additionally flat magvel will furthermore increase stability and consistency. Tunnel vision is a great perk for the third pro since it will be also activated when reloading after a defeat and will highly improve target acquisition and aim down speed. A very nice PvP role with high range and high overall stats can use celerity which will highly buff handling and reload speed. This role will be performing very good and maximizes the stat benefits of this weapon. Also it will make it highly lethal when you are the last fighting member. What is your opinion and which perks would you prefer? Give me your opinion in chat while I'm live on Twitch or YouTube or simply leave a comment. If you would like to download this wallpaper which shows all stats and god roll perks of this weapon you can join my discord. The link is down in the description. Thanks for tuning in and don't forget to like, share and subscribe and check out my media. Have a good one.